My name is Chris and I'm 12 years old. Hello, my name is Will and I'm 11 years old. My name is Desiree and I'm 18 years old and I've been in foster care for about 13 years now. My name is Jack, I'm 13 years old and I don't know how long I've been in foster care. They want what every child deserves. I'm Christopher. A loving home. I'm 18 years old and I've been in foster care for 13 years. A family of their own. My name is Brown. I'm 17 years old. I've been in foster care since I was born. In Montgomery, Alabama, this is the Brantwood Children's Home. Come on to the house. A place for kids from families broken beyond repair. They're all between 10 and 21 years old, and like Will, all available for adoption. Yes, I think about it. Will's a fifth grader in his seventh school. And what goes through your mind? Like, what kind of family will adopt me? When will it happen? Yeah. How will it happen and how will it, how will it turn out? Too often, it doesn't. Let me check with Ms. Cassidy. Uh, Kim Herbert is Brentwood's executive director. In your four years, how many adoptions have you had? We've not had any adoptions. Pierce is your heart. That's what we want for them. Adoption awareness has been heightened by the Haiti earthquake, which created thousands of new orphans. In the last eight weeks, more than a thousand Haitian children have come to America for adoption, more than the last three years combined. It's a new chance many Brentwood kids will never get. It's been too long for them, and that hope's gone, and they count on themselves. In 2008, America's foster care system had 123,000 kids available for adoption. 55,000 of them, only 45 percent, were adopted. And typically, the older they get, the worse their chances it will ever happen. I think because people have this notion that they should raise a baby, it takes a minute for people to wrap their head around, what if I took a child who wasn't an infant? Many states and agencies post albums of available children. Meet these kids and learn their hearts and see their needs and what they're after. Jack's after a second chance. At 13, he's the baby in a fractured family of nine. Would you still like to have a home yes. of your own? And will that happen one day? I'm praying for it. They all are, praying for a family that, so far, is just a dream. Mark Strassman, CBS News, Montgomery, Alabama.